So, hello. I'm Jay from Another Dying, and I am good. Thank you for asking, Sid Treefish. Thank you for showing up. So, I'm going to play something different. I'm not going to play Caves of Cud today. I'm going to play something else, but I'm going to stay kind of in my, in my usual wheelhouse by playing a roguelike. Um, let's switch here. Hi, that's me. I'm gonna do a thing with a camera. <clears throat> Usually don't really like to do that, but whatever. I will not introduce a face cam to my Caves of Cut streams. But, you know, when I'm playing something else, might as well. So let's start the game. So what I'm going to play, let's see whether that, uh, whether that actually shows up. It should, I've tested it with a bit of delay. But, um, bum, bum, da -dum, bum, bum. come on, hello, mm. it doesn't, it does, hello, yes, this is the brilliant, the fantastic title screen of Valhalla, Valhalla is kind of an interesting one, it is a game I haven't really known anything about until I read about it this week on a blog, um, this is one of the games that kind of passed me by, this is a roguelike from 1993 for MS-DOS computers. Um, and it is kind of in the mold, or 92, 93, I think the European version was a bit later and that came out in 1993 and that's what we're playing. Um, it was, it is kind of in the mold of the early roguelikes. I've just taken a quick look at it. I've not really played it, but uh, from what it seems, it's kind of in the mold of the early roguelikes. You know, your hacks, your rogues, your Mike's Adventure games, these kinds of games. Um, and interestingly enough, it was a commercial release, like a, a commercial retail boxed release. In fact, the version that I have here, I have installed from floppy disks. I haven't done that in a while, but uh, it all worked out fine. And that's neat. So if you want to play this game, you can kind of get it. Nobody sells it anymore, but you can find it. If you just put Valhalla DOS into Google, you will find this game. Um, and, uh, and yeah, I haven't really played it, so we're going to figure this game out together. Okay, let's go. First thing that is interesting about this is... Um, we can play this as beginner or expert. Beginner mode allows the adventurer to permanently back up at their discretion, provided the backups are at least 200 turns apart, which is kind of an interesting system. So we can kind of forego the permadeath in this. Um, but even on expert mode, we can still do that, but only after every 4,000 turns. I don't know if we're going to use it or if I'm going to go with full permadeath. And I also don't think that beginner and expert has any, like what it, what it says is, I think it does not have really anything else. We're gonna play an expert. Um, Maybe we're gonna, I mean, if the game gives us the, op the option to do that, maybe we can do the, every 4,000 turns back up, you know? So we don't completely lose a character, but maybe I'm going to play it actual with actual permadeath because I'm used to do that, but whatever. We're gonna play on expert. Um, adventurer description. Okay, so. Oh, this, okay. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Choose an apprenticeship. I think this is classes. These are the different classes in the game. So we can play a viking, a woodsman, a sage, an alchemist, a blacksmith, or a conjurer. The interesting thing here is the blacksmith, right? I don't know what we can do as a blacksmith. Um, alchemist is probably like potion focused. I think what this game does is it has sort of the classic rogue-like and by that I mean, like the original rogue, we have potions and we have scrolls. And ap apparently, like, alchemists are better at potions and sages are better at scrolls. It, that's at least what this suggests to me. Woodsmen would be, like, ranged stuff, I guess. 
So we would use the throw command a lot. Viking seems to be like fighting stuff. Blacksmith is very interesting. Again, because I don't know what a blacksmith would do in that mold. There's probably a bunch of mechanics here that we don't know. Conjurer is spells. Viking is punching. Blacksmith is using... Maybe you can, you can craft weapons or you can modify weapons or something in this game. All very interesting. Um, how a character would revolve around potions in a classic roguelike. Yeah, right? Maybe an alchemist can actually f like make potions. It would be pretty interesting. I think we're going to be boring for my actual first run. Again, I have not really played this before. I've just taken a look at it, whether it works or not. I think we're going to go with the Viking for now. You know, like just having someone who can bump fight. Bump fight. Um, good. Well, uh, I think that would, be, that would be useful at the start just to figure this game out. So we're going to do this. Your village, once peaceful and thriving, is now all but deserted and overrun by... Oh, dear. Beefy McStabby is indeed a good learning character. One thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to turn on... Oops, now the game is gone. Sorry. But I need to turn on desktop audio so you can hear the amazing sounds of this game. Um, and it's pretty loud. We might actually turn that off at some point. Ooh. That is actually ear-piercing in my ears. I hope you... Whew. Okay, there's someone in the chat that is black on black. I can't see anything. Um, your name is black on black. Fail Pansu with the... I think that's day nine in that emote, isn't it? I like day nine. That's a good dude. Um, okay. Let's see. Okay. Overrun by wild creatures from the nearby forest. That isn't day nine. Okay, it looks like day nine to me. Well, okay, whatever. Uh, press any key to venture on. What creature from nearby overrun? Okay, so our our town is bad. Press any key to venture on. And here we go. We are in the game. You may toggle sound on and off with the old S key at any time. We might do that. We might do that. Ah, where is my? Wow. I managed to just tangle my ear stuff, my earphones, around the armrest of my chair. Good stuff. I'm a professional at this. So, this is already interesting, right? Um, so, this game has a graphical user interface. It has a GUI. And we have kind of, like, one weird thing is we have this small very like abstract depiction but we also have kind of a zoomed in view and as you can s as you can see we can kind of you know we kind of walk around in uh, in both you know this is just a more zoomed in view so we have more detailed tiles and stuff here so you know there's a potion there's an apple we can use the mouse um, it's not ASCII and we have a graphical user interface and we can still play it like a normal roguelike, you know, I think the we have also, yeah, I think this all works. Call, we can, that's probably throw, indeed, we can, that is where, that is wield. So the the commands are essentially exactly what you imagine them to be. We can dig, that's kind of a new one, an interesting one. Can we dig? Without a pickaxe. We need a pickaxe for digging. Okay, that's interesting. Um, the commands seem to be pretty much in the classic roguelike mode. So you can see we have wear and wield. So we wield weapons and we wear armor. So that is very much, that is from rogue, directly from rogue. Do we have put on or do we wear rings? Use item. There's other stuff. There's panic. I don't, apparently we can panic and we can eat obviously we can read throw shoot um we have a map we don't oh yeah we have a map oh nice we have a world map of the map tiles the zap option is also um a classic roguelike command you can do that in in hack in net hack in rogue if you have a wand you can zap with the wand 
So it was always Z or Z for zap. It's always good. Mix. Okay, we can mix potions. That is very interesting indeed. That is something that's not in Rogue or in Matak, as far as I know. We have discoveries. Okay, this tells us what we have identified already. So we know the, the ring of agility, soul trapping. I think these are wands of light, ice and fire. Scrolls, dispel hex, identification and blessing. So we already know what a, what a identification scroll is. That's kind of cool. Curing strength and speed. So we know what a potion of strength is, which is also very good. Um, because that is always trouble in, in classic rogue. What's that playback? Yes, we have playback. What does that do? Okay, playback just plays you back previous messages. You cannot dig without a pickaxe. That we that's something we had earlier. You can pay at shops, so there are shops in the game. Pay and sell. Skill, what skill? You have no applicable skills. Well, that's not the first time someone has told me this. Um, power, you have no applicable powers. Well, great. NPC, assist witch adventurer. Okay, so we can, you can only assist loyal Norsemen. Weird, okay, we can assist other NPCs. Type question mark for help. You may choose a place on the screen in two ways. Click anywhere. Use the keyboard, move the cursor, blinking, input the period, enter or spacebar keys to complete this action. Okay, can we actually, yeah, we can move outside of our little window and can just, uh, feels bad man indeed. Um, I think I do have a, let's press panic, I want to know what panic is. Wait. Oh, I, I, comparison in progress, disc flip, yeah. I know what this is. This is a boss key. Remember boss keys? So, this game was probably presumed to be played at work. And when your boss came, you pressed the panic button. And now it looks like we're doing something in, in DOS. Press escape and we're back in the game. Ah, yes, boss keys. I mean, it's kind of awesome that it's called panic. So we have call and name. So, um... This is probably to to name items, but I don't really know. Look at settings. Let's take commands to throw help topic. Can we actually, can I ask what this is about? No. Name, name which, no. How can I help topics, commands? Type any key or use the mouse. Okay, let's see, what is call? The call command is used to call an entire class of items by a given name. To unknown types of scrolls. Okay, so if we have an item, like a scroll, ring, potion, or wand, that we don't know what it is, but we have an inkling, we can give it a name, so we can work with that. That makes sense. Um, name? A single item or stack of like items a name. Differentiate this item from others which are similar to it. Ah, okay, so if we have two same things, right? If you have, okay, I know what this is. So call means we have like a, like a red potion. So we can call all red potions heal, for example, if we don't know what it is, if it's not automatically identified. And then every red potion will be called heal. Whereas name would be, we can, we can name like a mace and that mace is then called Jeff instead of all the other mazes, which are not going to be called Jeff. Okay, everything makes sense. Good, I'm figuring this out. I think we should actually start playing this game. How about that? I think that would be a good idea. So, we are in a house with an apple and a potion. Just like in real life, a food ration. We have auto pickup on. Orange potion, food ration. We have a ring of soul trapping, so we can trap souls. Very interesting. We have six potions of curing, which is interesting. I don't know if that's healing or curing status ailments. I don't know. Okay, there's something here. Can we wait? Nobody is here. Okay, you missed the gnome. Did I turn off the sounds? I don't hear anything. Oh, no, I didn't. Uh, there's one issue. Apparently the sounds are actually delaying actions. I'm absolutely going to turn them off because there was a sound playing 
and I couldn't do anything. It buffered the action, and that was supremely annoying. Okay, no sound for us. You hit the drag, the drag hits. Splashes you. Did that do anything? Did we lose? No? A dead drag. Okay, we picked up the drag. Okay, we picked up the corpses. That is not useful. Um, I wonder if this actually does the intrinsic things. Where we... Crab? What crab? Is a drag a crab? A food ration, gold pieces, okay, and a grey cloak. Um, I need to actually turn off auto pickup. Settings, maybe? Oh yeah. Pickup is off. Fantastic! This is a very... I don't know, this is very convenient. This is a very convenient interface. The following items are here, a lot of them. We have a... Okay, we have a lot of stuff. So we're going to pick up the potion of strength. I wonder if this actually increases strength. Can we quaff? Yeah, Q for quaff is drinking. Didn't we pick up the strength potion? Wait, C. Ah, I see. Braces, a grappling hook, very interesting. Let's pick all of this stuff up, but not the corpse. Um, quaff, let's drink the potion of strength. And that has increased our strength, but only marginally. Look at the dead gnome. You see a dead gnome. Examine. We can also examine stuff, like in Caves of Cud. That's very interesting. Orange potion. Does this do anything? No. We have an orange potion and an oily potion. Ring of soul trapping. It's all very interesting. This also seems to have a more open structure than... It's not a single dungeon thing, I think. And we seem to be spawning. Everywhere, you kill the gnome. What do we have? Let's pick up. Okay, Peridot ring and a shiny scroll. Both of them, we don't know what it is, but let's pick it up. Do we have them? Yeah. Do we have any scrolls? We do know what a scroll of identification is, so we don't need to actually search for that. There's a bunch of items in the over there. You see an arrow? Somebody shot at us. Maybe it was a trap. I don't know. Well, this interface takes something to go to get used to, but uh, yeah, eighteen point eight zero eight strength indeed. That's not a lot. Oh, that's that's a shop. And okay, what do we have? Grappling hook. Okay, wand of fire. Scroll of identification for one hundred gold. We have a thousand and forty, which is nice. So we might actually pick up a few of these. Ring of agility costs a thousand. Potion of Curing, Potion of Strength. These are pretty expensive, actually. Um, we might actually... I'm going to pick this up. The doors close. Okay. Let's get a few scrolls of identification. These are going to be very useful. Um, how do we pay? P? Powers? Yes. More. Okay. We pay for all of them, and we can go out. Okay. Interestingly enough, the doors close. So we cannot really... I don't know how stealing would work right now but we can check that out gold pieces pick them up a b there we go i think i'm kind of enjoying this <laughs> you killed the drag all right dead drag and another gnome what is this a pit okay let's not drop there do the gnomes that's weird okay then Two dead gnomes and two urns. What is an urn? It shows up as a food item. Do we eat from an urn? That's that's weird. Can you look at them? It just tells me it's a gnome. Mm. Two more identification scrolls. The game really can... And one scroll of Dispel Hex and a Smoky Potion. The game really throws items at us, doesn't it? Probably need to eat something real soon. Can we eat the urn? Because it has a food thing. This is kind of disturbing to me, but we're gonna try. A. Pick up an urn. Eat the urn. Isn't urn something different than I'm thinking? 
like urn for me is a thing where you put like a container for the ashes of a dead person am i missing something is there something else that could be an urn <laughs> eat contains meat okay it is a container Reality TV show where a woman couldn't stop eating a dead husband who was cremated. What the hell are you watching? This, no. Okay, um, the corpse is actually despawn after a while. I wonder if it does... You can, you, can, you know, in that urn there was meat, so... I mean, that is very... Let's pick up the other one and let's eat it as well. There's nothing here. Okay, let's eat an, a green powder. You feel much stronger. Wow, that actually gave us a bunch of stuff. You killed the Ansk, whatever an Ansk is. It was on YouTube. <laughs> you can't tell that it was on, yeah. Very hard, changing channels. Um... Okay, let's see. Especially on YouTube. Okay, strength. I mean, that's cool. So urns can be all kinds of stuff. There's probably also urns that have bad things in them, right? Drag, let's murder the drag. You see here, a dead drag. Let's explore our little village. It told us that we could back up every 4,000 turns. I don't know how you can actually do it, though. I don't know. Whatever. Let's keep going. Let's just ex I wonder if it's actually useful to explore the whole map. We're gonna see. We're gonna be a little bit... Uh... Okay. Alright. What's this? It's another urn, yeah. Pick it up. We're gonna eat from it. I want to know what everything does. Contains nothing. So does it just go away? Yeah, it just goes away. These are just kind of temporary containers, I feel. So we have a peridot ring and we have a lot of spells of identification. So what we're gonna do is we're going to read a spell of identification and we're going to do this. No, J. Um, a ring of insulation. What does happen if we examine it? You see an, a ring of insulation, okay. I don't know what insulation does, is the interesting thing. Can we wear it? Yeah, we can. We have a plus three leather, leather armor as well. Let's put on the ring of insulation. That sounds pretty good. Maybe it's good against like electricity or probably, right? Um, but the game is very, scarce with telling you what things do you know i don't know if soul trapping is any good for example let's change maps oh that's very cool you get you get these little screens usually keeps you warm and oh, that makes sense but it could also keep you cold if it's too warm you know Lead off in every direction as you find yourself wandering into a dense forest. Here we go. The forest. Let's take a look at the map. Yeah, it's directly next to it. It shows us where we can... Traveler's Log. Okay, so we are right now in Midgard, I think, right? That's what this is. We are in Midgard. This is Yggdrasil, the world tree. Like my little, the little bit of knowledge I have about Norse mytho mythology. Um, like this is the bridge that leads to Asgard, right? The realm of the gods. Um, down there is where the, probably Jotunheim, where the, where, the, where the giants are. And there's other stuff that I don't know. There's a chessboard, I don't know what that's all about. Um, <laughs> Okay, I'm not very firm in Norse, Norse mythology, I must admit. Let's pick that up. We have wild dogs. Don't seem to be very dangerous. I don't know how to wait a turn. Which is weird. 
Like waiting a turn is very useful. A decayed scroll, okay. Like how could we, okay. If we, I'm just clicking on me, I wait a turn, but I don't know what I can do. Movement, up, down. Rest is five, yeah, but it doesn't work. It does not work. No, it works. Okay, that was a numlock thing. Mm. Potion of curing. Okay, we can we can use that. We're actually hungry now. It's kind of nice. That there's a homun homunculus. Always, I love that word. It subdues me. The bite. What does that do? Okay, we're kind of stunned now. Okay, that's bad. Probably. You can move again. Can we murder the homunculus? Yeah, we can. Only two XP. Yeah, I think XP is actually our level and not our um, not our experience points. If I would hazard a guess, that's also from Rogue. It's kind of interesting, right? This game came out in 1993. That's pretty late, actually, for this type of game. Um, and I've looked up a few like reviews from magazines, mostly from German magazines, and. They weren't kind on this game, but it actually kind of makes sense if you think about it like 1993 in that year like that's a year after Ultima Underworld, right? Um, that's Yeah, spear, okay well, Let's get the spear. We can probably throw that Okay Ultima Underworld was indeed really good. A dead gnome. Right. But for now, this actually seems kind of sweet. I can see myself playing this for a bit. Let's see where the... A flimsy scroll. Okay. There's an imp. Killed an imp. That's good. Feels like doom suddenly. Uh, let's see... I'm going to eat something. I'm going to eat a food ration. Oh, that really doesn't do a lot. There's a pickaxe. So food is going to be a problem, I think. Um, let's identify some stuff. We have a lot of scrolls of identification. We have a buzzing sound. Wait. Oh, we have... I, but that was a super identification scroll because we have identified everything in our inventory. So we have potion of curing of constitution. That is good. We can probably increase our constitution. Holy water if we run across a zombie, I guess. Soul seeking and curing. There's kind of a soul system here. We have soul seeking. We have a ring of soul trapping. Um, I don't exactly know how that works. Maybe we need to use the item or something. Okay. Grey cloak and braces, they don't seem to be cursed. So we're going to put that on. Category to God of War to troll, troll people. Uh, yeah, we could do that. But uh, how about not? <laughs> I think Twitch does not look kindly upon these sort of things. Um, okay, first of all. Let's quaff a potion of constitution. That increased our constitution, indeed. By one, I think. Um, let's quaff... Do we have anything else? No. Let's... Wear? No. Wear? Yeah, there we go. Let's wear... I'm not wearing insulation anymore, which is weird. Okay. Braces, cloak. Okay, enter. Currently worn. Yeah, we have insulation, braces, and a gray cloak. That makes sense. There's a kobold. It actually does a bit of damage. And two flint knives. We're gonna pick up the two flint knives. I need to actually get used to... You have a cursor, but you cannot actually pick things with the cursor, which is... 
kind of weird, but you need to actually press the press the thing, press the key. Leather boots. Cool. Should we just and a helmet? Okay. Yes. Ten arrows. We don't have a bow though. Usually you can throw arrows without using a bow. But yeah. For now everything seems to be kind of all right. Which turn is it? Yeah. 4,000 turns is actually a lot. I mean, that makes sense. So for expert mode. So you actually, you do lose, you can lose a bunch of progress by dying, even with the backup. I mean, that makes sense. You know? Oops, where am I? Oh, there was a teleporter. There was a teleporter. I got teleported away. And we can dig, right? With the pickaxe. Drop. No, I dropped it. I did not. How can you dig? Let's drop. DM. Mm -hmm. I don't know how you. you cannot dig without a pickaxe. Give me that pickaxe. Which direction? You cannot dig there. Okay. Maybe it's something specific. Maybe you can't just dig willy nilly. I guess. I guess. Okay. Boom. Let's keep exploring. We haven't really run into anything super terrible just yet. But there are some things that are A, B, C that are worrying me. Especially the food situation. Um, I'll just pick up that stuff. We have an ocarina now. So there's an urn. We're gonna eat from the urn. Rotten food. You gag. Ugh. Eat. Eat a food ration. You eat the food ration. Here we go. Experience three now. Hmm. Did we level up? We didn't get a message for that. It's weird. Oh yeah, that's the that was the teleportation trap. Jeez. Okay. I think we need to actually get exploring faster. Because we cannot like linger around as much as we do. Eat. Rotten food, you gag. Oh, that's bad. That's a serpent. And a nilb. I mean, very interesting. Probably we need maybe we need to start eating corpses. So I I wonder if this game has sort of the system of intrinsics. Um, so in NetHack, you can gain certain things, certain intrinsics from eating corpses. Um, but I don't know. Let's eat the dead. It tasted horrible. We're still hungry. Didn't really do anything. There's another food ration. That is good. Another urn. Eat D. Contains food. Okay, cool. A woomera. Okay. Throw. Let's throw our spear. Oops, no. Um, now we're in melee. Whatever. Okay. Crude Swiss dead human pale potion and a ring of agility. Okay, so let's pick up the potion and the ring. Um, we're gonna wear. No, not wield. Wear. Always a thing. Agility. Let's wear that. And uh, okay, we don't know the helmet or the leather boots. We have enough identification stuff, so. And two yellow potions. Let's pick up those. We have not really run into inventory limits yet, which is all right. And there's a ring of insulation again, another one. A gorget. What's a gorget? Gorget. What is that? Okay. And let's pick it up. There's another scroll of identification and a bunch of gold. Okay. We're going to read. Oh, empower with. with which, not with. Um, insulation, will I want? Okay. I want to know what this is. Oh no, I, what am I doing? I, a plus one gor, what is a gorget? What does it look like? Huh. Let's put it on. 
Looks like armor, yeah. It looks like sort of like Conan Barbarian, the Barbarian, like, armored underwear, something like that. But yeah. Okay, I mean, let's continue. Potion of Strength. I'll take that. Okay, what are we wielding, actually? Stealth. Oh, we're in perfect health. No skills, no powers, no abilities. We have cold resistance. That is what the insulation does. Okay, that makes sense. It covered the throat. Yeah, or the... You know. Okay, the EXP is indeed experience points because we are apparently a level 2 Viking. Um, we have two eyes and eight fingers. <laughs> Okay, apparently we can lose them. We have a speed of 10 and high morality. There's a lot to this game. That's good. We have a maze. Are we actually... What are we wielding? Oh, we have a plus one maze that we are wielding. Okay. Helmet and a dead gnome. Um, let's read identification Q. And let's do this. Z. A okay, plus zero helmet. That's good. So, where? Gorgut helmet. Okay, these are different things, so it's not a. Let's put those on. Yeah. I mean, that probably makes sense, right? Armor class is minus three, so. Yeah, apparently we have no thumbs. Maybe you can, can't lose the thumbs. I think what this is is um i think what this is oh the ring of agility could have been cursed we were lucky we it could have been a minus agility thing mm. so first of all we have a negative uh armor class is the lower the better apparently which is was kind of usual at that point Kind of, it's kind of a thing that comes from D and D. Kill the imp. An agate ring. Let's pick that up and the clear potion. Gnome. There's an urn. We're just gonna get the urn and stuff that into our face. So no thumbs. Yeah, I think the fingers is about like how many rings you could can put on. If I will. To hazard a guess, um, urn contains nothing. Yeah, well, just crunch on the urn itself. There's a shield. We can still carry. I wonder what the limits of inventory are. Or what it does, you know? Like if you're over in Nilb Homunculus, oh, let's kill the Homunculus first. Because it does bad stuff. Bolts. Oh, 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 it's a shop. It's all a thousand. Maybe we can actually sell some stuff, you know? Sell. Yes, indeed, we can sell some stuff. Um, insulation. Let's sell the other ring of insulation. I don't think we need two. Okay. Yeah, good. Sold. Um, what else can we sell? Oh, we do have a potion of strength. I should quaff that. Um, will a wand? All stuff that we don't really know what it does. It's kind of interesting. We have a scroll of identification that is only worth one. And scrolls of identification that are worth 50. I wonder what the what the deal there is. They don't have the three bend points. Uh, I mean that makes sense. Yeah. A scroll of wonder. I don't also know what that is. Grappling hook, pickaxe. The ocarina is worth a lot as well. Hmm. Do we have anything good here? Insulation, bone ring, ring of agility. Another one. Pearl ring, sand ring. Sard ring, not sand. 
jet ring, pearl ring, so all kinds of rings that we don't know what it is. Crude spears, viscous potion, and an emerald ring. Hmm. I mean, rings are cool. Rings are awesome. A foul potion. Okay. I wonder if that actually has anything to say, or whether that is just a random thing. Willowy wand, another one. Okay. At that point, I'm Zelda. What's with that Zelda? I. can't remember what I said. <laughs> um, at this point, we're going to read a scroll of identification. R. Yeah, it says N N. I think it's cursed. I think that scroll of identification is cursed, but I don't know what it does. Maybe it unidentifies a bunch of stuff. Could be. B. A wand of polymorph. Okay, and that can be useful. You know, if we run across something really terrible, we can use our wand of polymorph and polymorph it into a chicken or whatever. Pit. Okay, let's change maps. Where are we? Well, let's go south, right? Why don't we? Gold pieces, gold pieces, gold pieces. Scroll of blessing. Let's bless something. Like or leather armor glows. Okay, that's just now we have a plus five leather armor. That's pretty good. I wonder if there's like um, rust stuff. I hate bats. Okay, level four. Okay. Kill the cobalt. I think that's a teleportation trap. Um, cursed scroll of dispel curse. Yeah. I wonder what that. Maybe it just curses everything. Could be the case. But it's kind of interesting that the single things. Of, the sun is actually shining into my room. Um, which makes it kind of difficult to deal with. One moment. Here we go. Can't have the sun. <sighs> While I'm playing on the computer, you know. Let's take a look at self. Uh, level three Viking, but we're level four. I, I'm not really sure. Maybe, maybe that is the the class or something, and that is our character level. Maybe there's a difference there. I'm not sure. Okay, dead serpent, urn. Eat, urn. This urn could It's a matryoshka urn. Okay, eat, urn. And that contains nothing. Right. Right in my eyes, indeed. It's still right in my eyes. Close that a little more. All right. Oh, there's a ring. Corpse hits. Leather armor. Okay, we're going to keep our oh, leather. My skin crawls with disease. That's bad. What does disease do? Now we are diseased. Maybe we can quaff a potion of curing. You feel much better. Okay. Does that heal? Or? Yeah, that also cures disease. Good. All right. Good thing that we have a bunch of them. Um. Oh no, that was not six of them, that was B. I don't know. I think that means it's blessed. So we have holy water. But N means we don't know if it's cursed or not. I think identification C, that means it's cursed because it wasn't... Um... Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, we are hungry. Ah, yeah, we're kind of getting there, aren't we? Let's eat a food ration. We're still hungry. Earn. Eat. D. Contains nothing. Ooh. Food is indeed a problem here. 
that's another thing here. A black mushroom. Let's fucking eat the black mushroom. Your eyes bleed. Oh, that's probably bad. <laughs> if your eyes bleed, then we're in perfect health. Just got a little bit bleeding in the eyes. Yeah, at least we don't need that. <laughs> that would be terrible, wouldn't it? Okay, Nilb Dreg. Yeah, that's leather armor on the corpse. On the corpse of the corpse? No! No! Where's my game? Where's my game? My game just minimized for some reason. A chart scroll. I think at some point we probably need to start... What was the last thing? You can move again. Oh, a stun gas trap. Okay, that's what that was. Hey, the playback thing is actually pretty useful. There's an anvil. Probably useful if we are a blacksmith, which we are not. There's another, there's a green mushroom. You know what? We're just eating all the mushrooms. Tasted like dirt. Okay. I wonder what happened when our eyes bled. I think our stats have not changed, though. We have 2,000 gold, though, which is nice. Blink on your enemies and bleed on them. Just freak them out, yeah. Fire vision. I mean, do we have powers? Oh yeah, fire vision. Indeed. Maybe that was that. Huh. That sounds kind of awesome. Let's do the power. Fire vision. In that direction. The tree is incinerated. I'm kind of into that. I don't know how the power stuff works it's like it's not magic it's not a spell isn't it so we don't have any magic skills at least did that use food hmm. walnut wand yeah sure bleached root okay let's take that let's eat the bleached root you eat the root Okay. Fire vision power. I just Okay, the power went away. So apparently that was a temporary thing. Okay. Huh. I mean, eating a random mushroom in the forest and getting fire vision power is pretty awesome, right? Um let's keep eating mushrooms. You go blind. Yeah, well, fantastic. Self. I wonder if that is temporary or not. But we are in kind of. I hate going blind in a roguelike. Oh, we can see again. That was very temporary. Good. <laughs> I mean, eating a mushroom, a random mushroom in the forest, and then going blind would freak me out for sure. Oh. Okay. We have a diary and a papyrus scroll. Two urns and a pearl ring and gauntlets. Okay. So. We're gonna read Scroll of Identification U. Um, and I want to identify. Maybe we should do the boots first. It's plus zero. Okay. So let's wear the leather boots. Let's quaff our potion of strength. We should have done that earlier. Um, let's eat urns. Nothing. Eat urn. Contains food. Awesome. That's great. That mushroom did give me temporary fire vision. That's indeed. Random things can grant you power. Yeah. It does. You have so many things. We have a bunch of rings. We have an agate ring, kunzit ring, and a pearl ring. Kunzite? Kunzite? I don't know. Um, ba -ba -ba -bum. Okay, let's... How many identification scrolls do we have left? Just one that isn't cursed. Mm -hmm. Um. So let's do one ring. The pearl ring? A ring of draining. That doesn't sound good, to be quite honest. I wonder if it drains us, or what's this? Pool of lava. Well, just stepped into a pool of lava. Scroll of blessing. Hmm. 
And a sard ring. Yeah. Eat the dead imp. Tastes it horrible. I don't care. Um, okay. There's something I wanted to do. I forgot about it. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh yeah, right. Read. Blessing. Leather armor. We're gonna bless our armor as much as we can. So now it is plus six. Okay. That was if you like in in Rogue. That's a very useful thing. Oh, there's an orc. Orc is dead. There's another orc, but you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to eat this orc. So that this one will just freak out. Don't know if that happened, but yes, indeed. Okay, there's a food ration, I think. Yeah, give me that food ration. Food is definitely a source of anxiety here. A silver sword. Okay, give me that. Scroll of cartography. This will probably just reveal the map, right? Let's do cartography. You. Visualize your surroundings. Okay. So we know all the all the things on the map at least. We can only go north from here. Take a look at the big map. Okay. This is what it looks like for now. Another Woomera. Scroll of identification, that is good. Give me that. Let's quaff. Ah, oh, well, let's try to survive normally. We're taking a bit of damage here. A Psy and a Warhammer. Tastes it horrible. Oh, that was poisonous. That's bad. Oh, that's very bad. Is poison a status or just... No. That's just a one-time damage. Okay. Eat an anak if you come across one. Okay. I actually did come across one. So it does intrinsic stuff, apparently. The raven speaks. Say summoning scrolls until you are in need of aid. Oh, that's nice. Thank you, raven. Isn't the Raven Odin? Wretch wheat. Oh. We're nauseated. Okay. There's a lot of wretch weed here. A food ration. We should probably eat one. Okay, let's try that. Oh, uh, no. Okay. I'm gonna have to wait for a bit recharge a bit of health but not too much so yeah, we're hungry again basically constantly hungry that's another silver sword um you know what let's wield this sorry let's wield a silver sword held don't know what it does. I wonder if we can, let's see. I think it is not cursed though. Yeah. Let's do the silver sword. That seems better, you know. Eat. Urn. Contains food. Awesome. Throw knives. Yeah. Right. Right. I should, I should do these things more. Um, have we been here before? No. But this does not really lead us anywhere because, yeah, we need to go east. Oh well, that's at least a food ration, so that's good. You know what? I'm kind of enjoying this game. I might play this a bit. Maybe that's something for Friday. You know? Monday is going to be Caves of Cud. But Friday might be this for a bit. Let's eat. No, let's not eat. <laughs> Something I wanted 
What did I pick up? I picked up something that I wanted to do. Good thing that my brain is just nonsense. Um, yeah, scroll of wonder. I wonder. I want to know what that is. Right. Let's try that. Your mouth feels dry. Scroll of wonder and my mouth feels dry. Didn't really do anything. Hmm. Did not really do anything. Food ration. Earn. Eat. Well, we're finding some food now. I don't know what that was. Contains an orange powder. Did that do anything? Did we get... Did we level up from that? I think we leveled up from that. That's cool. Kind of low on health. But, you know. Yeah, eat the urn directly. You feel much stronger. Oh yeah, the green powder. Dispel hex. Lava strike. Always good. If we need it. Oh. Fell into a pit. Okay, another food ration. Cool. All right, now we're back here. That's the shop. Um, I think we're just going to keep going. Yeah. Oh, stun gas trap. That's bad. Okay. Is that a dead nilb? No. Oh, there's more food. Give me that food. Green powder, you feel much stronger. Yes. 1887. We're getting that strength. Also, I have a bunch of gold at this point. You know what? Ring of agility, draining. Uh, bone ring. There's so many rings that we don't know about. The problem is, like, if we don't have identification, that doesn't really make sense to just buy it, you know? But how about we don't? Let's keep going. Okay, we're still in the forest. The forest is pretty big, although we seem to be reaching a little bit of a, of a corner there. Eat. We're just eating the urns. Food, yeah, thank you. Oh, there is a, an ansk. That's what you said, right? Um, anak, no. That's something different. You know what? I'm eating it anyways. A minor ache emanates from behind your eyes. Oh well, that is probably bad. Oh, we have sixth... Oh no, we have sixth... Sixth... Sense. Sixth... That's a difficult word. I don't know what sixth sense is. It's a difficult word for... When your native language does not contain THs. Um, leather boots, dead human, murky potion, D and E. Let's get those. Oh, there's a corpse. And a food ration. Oh, we can also start mixing potions together, actually. Let's eat directly from the urn. Meat, okay. Oh, and stronger again. We're almost at 19. Identification, very good. You know what? Let's drop the curse scroll of identification. I'm not into that. However, I'm going to read this scroll of identification. And I want to know what this ring does. Q. A ring of regeneration. Wow, I want that. Absolutely. Q. We're going to put that on. Eat from the urn. It contains food. Okay, we're getting kind of. I'm I'm beginning to have a little less anxiety about food. You do actually find stuff. So there's another ansk. 
Okay, something killed the Ansk with a spear. Do we just regenerate faster now? Apparently we do. Huh. Uh, let's go north a bit because I think this will be... Yeah, okay. This is kind of the little area here. Oh, there's a lot of gnomes. Hello, gnomey. Okay. Three dead gnomes. Bunch of dogs as well. Let's just murder everything. Why don't we? Okay. Imp, imp, imp. Oh. From the manual. Good thing I do have that. Whoops. Let me see. I do actually have that. Where are my floppies? Okay. Okay, one moment. I should have. Valhalla. Here we go. Let's take a look. So, what was it? Monster pictured on page five. Ah, okay. That is a white. Ha, and it worked. Okay. Well, that's old games for you. Especially games on floppy disks used to have fun copy protection schemes where you need the manual for this. All right. Oh, let's, we have so many food rations. Let's just eat one. Okay. It's another Ansk. A wand of fire. Okay. Fire. Give me that. Boom. At this point we're just murdering the gnomes like nothing. What are you? What are you? You're running from me. Lacunar. It's not fighting me. Hmm. It's very interesting. A tepid potion? A scroll of blessing. We're going to bless the shit out of our armor. In uh, in Rogue, that is a thing that is very useful. Because at some point in Rogue, you meet enemies called Aquators. And the Aquators will permanently decrease your armor value. Um, if your armor is not protected, or if you are wearing an armor with metal on it. So one thing that you can do is you can take a leather armor, which is a weak armor, but you can bless it a lot and then have good armor that cannot be rusted. You know, that's just kind of the... Where's blessing? Blessing. We're going to keep going with that B. It glows. We have plus seven leather armor. So I don't know if we have this type of enemy in this game, but if we do, I'm just going to keep blessing my leather armor. What is this? Oh, it's a trap. Stun gas trap. Whoopsie daisy. 50 gold pieces. A dead ansk. I'm still not quite sure what sixth, sixth sense actually does. You hear noise, okay. Is that my sixth sense? Rather not, because hearing is just one of our normal five senses. Okay, um, hemp scroll. Oh, we have so many unidentified items. That always freaks me out a little. Scroll of Blessing. We're going to bless the shit out of our armor. Plus eight leather armor, yes. Hashtag blessed. Okay, there's these guys again, but I'm not sure what they do. Silken scroll, sure. A wordy scroll. Oh, we have so many scrolls. This is getting unpleasant. At least our inventory is automatically sorted. But still. Okay, let's go south again. Because this clearly does not lead to anything. There doesn't seem to be like any... I mean, there was the shop on the one thing. Another wand of fire. We need to zap more. Let's zap something, shall we? Okay. 
Oh, what are you? A Hrygar. Let's zap fire. Ah, that's just in one direction. A Milky Ray. Does not seem to be a good one. A Jet Ring. And another Scroll of Blessing. You know, let's get that. Let's get the Jet Ring. Boom. Your pack is full. Dang it. Okay. Oh no, now we're getting there. Now we're getting there. Can't really see. Yeah. Okay. We're going to read a few things that we can read. So we have the Scroll of Wonder. Let's do that again. The forest transforms into Wretchweed. Uh, yeah, well, that is great. Um, let's take our spear and throw it at the Wretchweed. Misses the Wretchweed. Well, that, that worked. Zap fire in this direction. It's the Wretchweed. It's incinerated. Boom, dead. We're level six. Oh, there's too many of them. Okay, we need to do something about this. Um, we're gonna zap fire this direction. Yes, incinerate this. And we can kill these one by one. We're gonna pick up the Wand of Blessing and the Jet Ring. We're gonna hit the bat, I guess. We're gonna read the Scroll of Blessing. We're going to keep blessing our leather armor. The frostbat hits nine leather armor. Yes. Okay. What else are we going to do? Um, we have so many rings. We have a bunch of... Oh, we have the empty vials from the potions. Okay. We don't need that many. Drop. I S T C E F G. Let's keep two empty vials, why don't we? Okay. Kind of, oh no. So wherever we go, the forest will turn into wretch weeds. Oh no. Oh, this is kind of bad. What's this? Weird fume. You grow another finger. Wow. <laughs> we stepped into a weird fume and we just grew another finger. There's more weird fume. Okay, things got weird now. Let's take a look at ourselves. We are in perfect health. Apart from us having one more finger. We have six fingers, including the thumb on one hand. But that is fine. Let's not worry about that. There's this foam everywhere. My mind is rearranged. Okay, this is all going bad right now. I need to leave this map. Scroll of Wonder apparently just does something random. My mind is rearranged. Okay, this, this, this is the end here. I wonder if we need to find a dungeon or something, because there does not seem to be an easy way out of this. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is all very interesting. Let's keep going. What's, what is this? Frost trap. Yeah, let's not run into that. Maybe there's like in the... Maybe in the mountain stuff there might be a cave or something. Yeah, let's figure this out. Let's eat the mushroom. Yes. My innards roll. Oh, I'm completely hungry now. Whoops. Eat the food ration. I need to eat a bunch of food rations now. Yeah, I wonder if there's like a cave entrance in the mountains or something. Scroll of identification. Okay, we're gonna read that. We're gonna identify one of the rings. I'm not wearing the regeneration ring for some reason. A ring of ashes, okay. Where? Regeneration, please. Oh, I need to... Ha! You cancel if you press escape. Uh, 
Okay. Rearrange this undiscovers your map. Okay. Hmm. Sure. Thing is. Okay. That's another ring of agility. Can we take multiple rings of agility? I wonder. You know, our speed is 10 right now. It might be cursed, though. That's kind of the problem. But you know what? Fuck it. We're just going to throw it on. Plus zero ring of agility. That's just weird. Um, self. We have 12 fingers now, apparently. Uh-huh. Also very interesting. So we essentially, including thumbs, have seven fingers on each hand. Clay lumps. You can eat clay lumps? No. I mean, eat a clay lump. Why did you eat that? Yeah, I, I wonder myself. Who are you? You see, you see Thok. Let's do NPC. Okay, that is not a Norse man, apparently. So we cannot... Hmm. Weird. I don't know what Thok does. Can we talk or something? No. You can just panic. I mean, you can always just panic, you know. That is always an option. Are you a fellow Norseman? Norseman? Loyal Norseman. Who are you? A ranger. But they seem to not be hostile. And they're not doing anything. Scroll of identification. Read. S. And we're going to read R. Ring of Famine. That's bad, probably. No. Yes. Tasted like dirt. I don't know what that did. Hmm. We had that before, but I don't know. Oh, we, we are fine so far, so... Oh, well. Whoa! I dropped into a cave. Okay. Well. You hear noise. Now we are in straight up roguelike dungeon land. Greaves and a food ration. Sure, let's pick it up. Ring of agility give, gives AC. Oh! Oh yeah, I mean that makes sense that it does. Um, well, there's a lot of stuff here. So we have a Grey Potion, Ash Wand, Onyx Ring, and an urn. No, I don't want to eat that, but I do want to eat from the urn. It contains nothing. Eat it. Contains food. Okay, that's good. Um, plus zero agility. Huh. We're not exactly... I mean, the silver sword seems to be working, but... Yeah, nothing, okay. There's these folks. I mean, can not do anything with you, right? No, it's not a loyal Norseman. Dead orc. Do anything with you? Oh yes! Assist the adventurer. Give? I mean, we can give them something. I wonder what the... Hmm. Don't know why you would do all of this, though. Yeah, have my Laura wand. What does that do? Okay. Take. A holocaust cloak? What the hell? What the fuck? Okay. Okay. I was not really expecting that. <laughs> um. Sure. <laughs> this 
game is weird. Okay, you are all fighting here. Let's kill a bunch of these orcs. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. Strange herb. I should, if I see a strange herb, I'm going to eat it. You hear noise. Okay. Did that do anything? No, we're, so we're still fine. We're not retching or anything. Icy potion. Well, the ring of gener regeneration really works, doesn't it? We are regenerating super fast. Oh, I dropped down. Oh no, it was a map change. Okay. Wow, this is... We're kind of in caves here. Let me see where we land once I take this. Um, how do we go up? Oh yeah, here. Oh, that's the entrance. Okay. That's another hemp scroll. I'm just going to read the hemp scroll because why not? Empower. Okay, we can use it on an item. Use it on the greaves. They disintegrate. Okay. So we don't have any greaves anymore, but that's fine. Ring of Ashes. I do have a Ring of Ashes. I'm not sure if I want to... Oh, and I'm full. I did something that I'm full. Wow. I don't know where that came from. But... Uh-huh. You know what? I'm just going to explore this dungeon level a little bit further. A Wood Dwarf. Okay. Grey crossbow and a grey bolt. I mean, that makes sense. Berserker. Lots of stuff here. Clear potion. Let's get the clear potion. Yapok. Don't know what that does. I broke my leather gloves. Hmm. It appears that I did. I do not in fact want to become famous. Can I? Oh, whatever. It's... I don't care. Okay. Um... Another soul seeker. And we, yeah, we have these diaries. Should we read from diaries? I mean, that's fun. One particular interest. A disperser helm protects against psionic attack. Do you wish to back up your. Oh, we can back up our game now. You know what? I'm just going to do that. And it's. Like that. Okay. The Great North Cave, 10 meters. Indeed. Okay. Oh, you, we fell through another trapdoor. Ah, things are going to get nasty now, aren't they? My mind is affected. Okay, I got addled now and ate a bunch of my food rations. How many do we have left? Six. Okay, that's fine. Let's read the wonder again. I'm not... Oh! Your armor strains and... Oh shit, we polymorphed into something. My armor bursts, and as I change form, four of my fingers are cut, cut off by rings. <laughs> oh god. Oh no. Oh no. We're now a basilisk. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, we are a basilisk. So we have innate power... Heat, poison, and petrification resistance, but we got rid of our armor. We cannot wear anything. Oh dear. And our armor is destroyed. Yeah. All of our armor is destroyed. And we still have our silver sword, though. Powers. 
innate power. Okay, we can... Okay, apparently we can do some fun stuff here. Begin to sink in, quick, sink in quicksand. I'm dead! Struggling in quicksand is useless, you die. Okay! Well! That is that. <laughs> I'm a lizard boy. I used a... Um, that was kind of nasty. I used a scroll of wonder and got transformed into a basilisk. And um, my fingers became bigger and were cut off by the rings. So that was terrible. And my armor burst. Whew. Oh, 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 yeah, right. We did the backup. Should I do that? Should I do that? I'm going to do that. Expert. And here we are. It feels like cheating. This actually feels like cheating. But if, the, if this is just a, an option in the game... I think I'm going to use it. Fuck it. Potion of Soul Seeking. Is that the trapdoor? Yeah, we actually avoided the trapdoor this time. Um, okay. We can go north here. These caves seem to be pretty, pretty elaborate, actually. There's nothing here. Wand, why not? Another 4,000 turns to do something silly, indeed. What the frick happened? Where am I? I'm here now. Uh, sure. Was that a... that was probably a teleportation trap. Food ration, sure. Good thing the... I mean, <laughs> that was pretty neat timing that the... that the backup just happened. Just this moment happened. Okay. Let's avoid the teleportation trap. Take the food ration. Um, there's a bandit. Bandit is dead. Eat the urn. Rotten food. Okay. That. Oops. That was a teleportation trap that we avoided. Is the sound on again? It seems unresponsive. Yeah, I'm going to turn off the sound. Because it makes the game unresponsive. Yeah, it's... sorry about that. The problem is that the game waits until the sound has played out. You know? Like, it actually waits until the sound has played out and it cues the actions and then performs them. And that is horrible. That is terrible. That you don't want that. Uh, a breeder? Well, that is kind of scary. There's another ring of agility. Let's pick that up. A breeder? Weird. Bandits? No, <laughs> it's definitely not. Okay, lower one light, a wand of light. That's kind of neat, actually. Let's get the wand of light. Hit by a poisoned barbed arrow. Wow, the regeneration is really awesome. With the Calvin. The Calvin rips out one of my eyes. Holy crap. That's unfortunate. We have just one eye left. Okay. Things can go sideways pretty quickly here. Ancient potion ornate scroll. Let's get those. Let's murder that archer. Insulation, agility, and famine. Okay. Let's get agility. 
So let's just put on a few more rings of agility. Why don't we? Okay. Yes. So even if it's plus zero, it's still... Oh, sorry, I, I missed your message there. Stone Shard. I have not heard of this game before. It is a roguelike, so I'm generally interested, but I don't know what it is, so... I might check it out. Might be a Friday game for me. Currently I try to not buy games too much because I have a lot of games that I like playing. Enchantress. Murder that enchantress. A vampire. Oh, that's bad. Oh, 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 oh. Vampires drain levels. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no. Vampires drain levels. There's an. Oh, no. I'm drained. Uh Okay. You can pray the prologue free on Steam. That's nice. Teleportation trap. We are at the vampire again. Pirta Af. Oh no. No? Let's eat the Pirta off. Okay, nothing happened. No intrinsic from that. Whew. Okay. Oh no, there's something that drains us of our strength. Okay. Scroll of identification, okay. G. The good thing is, if we die, we can still continue from our thing, which is kind of nice. I think I'm just going to play this as long as I can. Um, what do we have here? Onyx ring. T. A ring of locust mastery. Locus is kind of something that we say for toilet. So locus mastery is kind of funny to me. Um, but I'm not really sure what that does. T, locus mastery. Cryptic scroll. Ashes ring gives he six. He oh, thank you. Um, okay. I, how many rings am I wearing at this point? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can do one more. Yeah, so how about I do ashes? Thank you very much. A ring of ashes. Self, yeah, cold and heat resistance. That can't be bad, so why not? Um, I do have a scroll of identification. So, do I have anything? We should wear the iron shield, actually. Okay, it's not cursed, so... You actually wear it, yeah. L. Okay. Iron shield. Okay. Increase magic cookie. Let's eat the magic cookie and let's see what happens. The drugs. The magic cookie drugs. Stun jelly. Okay. All right. There's no stairs here, and there's one problem. 
where in order to go back we need to cross panic indeed um we need to cross this teleportation trap oh we can actually specify where to teleport i mean that's nice and this one as well okay so as soon as you know them you can actually use them huh let's go to a different thing whoa i fell through a trap door here we go i wonder if we can oh shit a werewolf is just murdering us wow that did a lot of damage play again yeah let's use that safe game we're going to continue on, on expert um yeah well, let's go a different direction that's kind of neat actually like i i don't intend to sort of master this game so it's kind of cool that we can just play it casually you know what is this a gnarled root okay a magician ah the sound is on again i'm sorry archmage oh that's bad probably Strange spell. Okay, level seven. Awesome. So we have a gray cloak, two war hammers. The archmage had two war hammers. Ring of ashes, gold ring, and identification scroll. Okay, gold ring K I. Here we go. We have an ancient potion. Don't know what that is. You know what? We're just going to try. Feel less substantial. That means. Oh, we have. Oh. It's a potion of phasing, which gives us 60 armor. 60 armor value. That's pretty good. Armor class, minus 60. That's what it is. Gnarled root. We're going to eat the gnarled root. Don't know what that does. You feel better. Okay. And we're. Fa oh, yeah, we can phase through walls. That's pretty neat. A red mushroom. Sure. I go blind. Bad, bad, bad. Okay, so we can phase, but that means um, Ruxicon. We also cannot hit enemies, right? Oh no, we can. Oh, Ruxicon, that did that rust our? Oh, it rusted our helmet. Ah, oh, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Okay. I need to zap you. I cannot be in melee with you. We are already in melee. It's bad. Let's do polymorph. Polymorph that. And what are you now? Nailbird. Oh! Wow. One hit kill. I... I'm blind, but I can still see. That makes sense. Yeah. Apparently the Nailbird is a enemy that we should not fuck with. <laughs> okay. Minus 91 health. That went really sideways really badly. Let's try this again. I wonder if this is... No, it's actually not the same. Okay, so it generates maps upon entry. That's cool. So it's different now. Ah, that's very good, actually. Yapok misses. Kill the Yapok. Ah, sound is on again. Okay, Mole Man, Yapok. It's interesting things here. Enchantress, murder the Enchantress. Burial Ring. Leather armor, scroll of blessing. You know what? Bless. Our oh, leather armor. Leather armor glows. And we are at plus 10. Very good. Scroll of identification, also very good. I'm gonna pick up both of these things. There's another gray, gray cloak. So, identification. I want to know. What do I want to know? Barrel ring, what is that? S. Relocation, okay, we can probably teleport with that. 
blood slug grabs me. Okay, that seems to be kind of like a like a leech. Oh, is that another vampire? Are you a vampire? It will zap you with fire. Zap. Incinerated. Awesome. Okay. I don't want to fight. Oh yeah, read that cartography scroll. I can do that indeed. Oh yes. Awesome. Okay. Amulet. What are you? Unaffected. Oh, this is a bad one. Oh, we killed it though. There's a katana. Let's get the katana. You know what? I'm just going to put it on. Oh no, it's a cursed weapon. It is a cursed weapon. Do we have to remove curse? We have dispel hex. That's probably remove curse, right? Read P. And we can put something else on now, right? Yeah. So the katana is not cursed anymore. Don't know what exactly it does, though. Do I have the cartography skill? I don't know. I have no skills. No. I wonder how you get these skills from books, maybe? Let's eat this. I don't know what it, what it does. No, it's just tasting horrible. Nothing about it. Okay. We have regeneration, which is very good. Uh, there's so many of these here. You know what? Let's get the viscous potion as well. As well. As well. Got very German there in my, for a bit. Dead moment. Okay. Oh, there's lots of these Mitch, Mitch Narts. <laughs> Don't know what that actually is. Scale mail. Nobody is here. I think we're going to stick with our leather armor. There's also no searching, interestingly enough. I'm searching for doors and stuff. Can I NPC you? Oh! Don't know what that was. Okay, that's not a loyal Norseman. Scroll of Blessing. We're gonna keep going with the Blessing. Um, let's bless our Katana for a change. Scroll of Identification. Okay. Eight rings of regeneration, yeah. I only have one, I think. Um, oops. A potion of mead. I, I used it on the thing. That wasn't good. Whatever. Onyx ring, that's the last one we don't know about. Ah, that was locust mastery. I still don't know what that is, but... I should probably take a look at the wiki at some point, but I am not going to do it for the duration of this of this stream. Can you call that axe guy? The thing is, calling is for items. You can't call creatures. Oh no, that's the werewolf. It's probably going to murder us immediately. We killed the werewolf. Okay. Can we eat the werewolf? Yeah. It just tasted horrible. Wow, that's a lot of damage that you get from these werewolves. But at least we can take them down if we hit them fast enough. I hope there's not many werewolves. Oh, fire dragon. Oh, there's, there's just all kinds of bad over there. How about we don't go there? How about we don't go there? Ah, uh, what's that? Some of my scrolls burn up. Oh no. You're too badly burned, you die. Okay, that kills you. So fire can kill you immediately if you are too badly burned. So you, uh-huh, even though it's, okay. 
good to know. I'm learning a lot about this game down here. Um, let's go north again. Let's try it again. We will have a different map now. I think I'm just going to be doing this for a bit. Hey, NPC. Let me NPC you. Assist the adventurer. Nothing to give me. Can I attack you? Well, this is probably a bad idea. <laughs> oh, I killed him. Okay. That's probably a bad idea. Um, curing, destruction, wonder. Scores of wonder have uniformly been bad until now. I'm going to try it again, though. My mouth feels dry. I'm not sure what that does. Like, it has, like, weird effects. That's what it does, but... Hmm. There's any key. Empty vial? Yeah, no. Ah, uh, sound is on again. Oh, his clay lump. Okay. What kind of birds here? Food ration that we don't really need. Crinkly scroll. Bunch of gold. Another mace. A mottled mushroom. Should we eat it? Yeah. Was delicious. Okay. Did that change anything? No. Okay. And that's an electric, electric worm, stun worm. Suddenly my stomach twists in pain. Well, that was probably something. <laughs> Don't know what exactly that was, but okay. And we need to actually drop a bunch of stuff now. Did I quaff all of my potions? I think I did. For some reason, I quaffed all of my potions at the same time. Something made me do that. Um, e G H K U. Okay. I, the thing is, I don't know where this leads. And there's a minion that we've killed. Another silver sword. Okay, we can murder a bunch of minions here. That's fine. Always hated those things as well. Makes you forced. Oh, that could be the case. Yeah. Like, Scrolls of Wonder have always just been bad. The, I, we killed a blur. We have a ring of agility. Let's eat the dead blur. You feel faster. Aha. Okay, so that was actually a thing. That makes sense. Um, take a look at the self. Ah, oh, yeah, that just increased our speed by a bunch. Cool. Leather armor. Scroll of identification. Yeah, that's probably... You're probably right with dry mouth. Um... We have anything else? Yeah, the onyx ring. That was the locust mastery, yeah. Oops, where? I'm going to wear the ring of agility. Just because a plus two ring of agility. That is great. I'm going to take a quick break. I need to actually get myself something new to drink. Go to the restroom. These kinds of things. And uh, I'm going to keep playing this for a little bit longer. Soul draining is not evil. Yeah, we started with it. I yeah, maybe we should actually put that on, right? Soul draining. Okay, so draining is soul draining. So this is not something bad. Okay. Take a look at the self. Okay. Indeed, my mouth is dry. And before I quaff everything, like my plants that I have around here, I should probably. So trapping. Oops. Hex draining. Oh, there's a hex on it. Ah, it's it's hexed. Okay, that's bad. So trapping. 
Um, draining is going to drain my health, probably. Do I have... Yeah, I have Dispel Hex, okay. Before I go, I need to quickly do that. Uh-huh. Let's take that off again. Gorg it back on. All right. All right, okay. Let me just quickly get this. We're going to put this on break and see you in a bit. Okay. Hello. I'm back. Cheers. So let's play this game for a little for a little bit longer. And um yeah. See where this goes.
Okay, there's a guy. That's a summoner. A new oh, a new soul inhabits your ring. Okay, I need to zap. Oops, I need to zap fire on you. Oh shit! I think the the fire one just bounced around the room. Um, did that destroy anything from me? No. A laurel wand. Let's pick that up. And now, like this, yeah, a Ruxico is in the soul trapping thing. <coughs> I do wonder what that does. And we can use item. No, that's these items. Okay. What does the ocarina do? Yeah, we played a tune. An ogre. That's bad. And we're dead again. Okay. Yeah, things get dangerous once you move away from these. Um, expert. Here we go. We're going to keep playing on expert. I don't want to back up every every 200 turns. That's just that's just ridiculous, you know? You need to kind of accomplish something before you do this. Okay, let's go up here again. So there's a lot of stuff that we haven't found. Oh, that are down there. Yeah, that's the that that's the caves. Okay, I guess we do need to explore the caves, huh? That seems to be the thing that we need to do. Let me just quickly explore the rest of this here. So I guess that is going to be the trajectory there. That we need to find the caves. And we use this to level up a bunch, find a bunch of stuff, and so on. And then we find the caves and we need to make our way through the ca through the caves, I guess. But there's some rough stuff down there. Ah, oh, sound is on again, sorry. Um, potion of curing. Yeah, let's pick that up. Can use that. Tepid potion. Scroll of identification. Yeah. The weird fume. Kill the weird fume. Green lump. Should we eat a green lump that we find somewhere randomly? I'm not sure. What is this? Pool of quicksand. Okay, quicksand just m killed us last time. So, let's not pick up the tepid potion okay let's go down again i think that's what, we're, what we need to do so we are here now um oops there's a food ration here yeah so we need to go left north bunch of places we need to go you know what we're going to go right first and explore this for a little bit. Food ration. Okay. Okay, and there's an ansk again. I wonder what happens if you eat it again. Okay, it does nothing. Eat the urn. Nothing. You hear noise. The chainmail and gold pieces. I'm going to stick with the leather armor. How about that? Or... Uh, Blessed. Oh, my strength is affected. My strength went down. I carefully build up strength. Blessing. No. So we have our silver sword. I want to try something. What happens if I do identification again on the silver sword? Plus zero. Okay, so now we know about that. So we're going to do blessing on our silver sword. I think we need to have better weapons. So, hit a monster. I'm drained again. Did something go down? Agility went down? What are we wearing? No. Hmm. Ring of draining. Bunch of stuff again. Okay, so Warhammer is kind of nice. Burn. Mm -mm -mm. Let's do that. Eat. 
So, strange herb. Eat the strange herb. Didn't really do anything. There's more mist. Eat urn. Smaller urn, sure. Contained food. Okay. We hear noise. Speckled growth. Another ring of insulation. Potion of strength. Quaff. Strength. You feel stronger. Good. All right. Ah, that's a shop. Ring of famine. Arrows. Icy potion. Tepid potion. Linden wand. Braces. Chain mail. An agility ring. Opaque potion. Potion of curing. Foul potion. Scroll of blessing. You know what? I'm going to buy that. Pay. Pay. Audit. Okay. You know what? Let's buy the Ring of Agility as well. Yes. The door's closed. Pay. Here we go. I mean, we have enough. We have enough money, right? So we can just can just do that. Okay. Doors open again. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to put on that Ring of Agility plus zero. It's fine. It's okay. Um. I'm also going to read the scroll of blessing. I'm going to bless my silver sword again. Just to have a weapon that's a little bit better than what we had before. Earn. Eat. Earn. Contain food. That's fine. We're extremely full. I think we don't need to really eat any everything that we come across. Although the urns are sometimes kind of good, so... Uh huh. Silk and scroll. A wraith. You lose a life level. What the hell does that mean? You lose a life. Uh. What is life level? Level four Viking. Is that no? It's not. Cockatrice. <laughs> I think we just lost a level. Just a normal level. I think that's what a life level is. Stone lacuna. We can still fill with water. Uh, well, that is very int And we drowned. Okay. Wow. <laughs> like, this can really catch you. This game can really just go sideways immediately. I wonder if you can actually do something about that. Hmm. Sorry for the apple eating, but sometimes you need a little bit of nutrition. Um, okay, we're gonna go over there again. We're gonna try this again. Is this different now? The thing is, we had already explored this. So, no, it's not different. It's the same. No, oh, it's just draining. Wow. Just. That was just. Oh, the ants can be bad, can't they? Just completely drained. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Good. 39 health. Let's get killed by the first thing we meet. Ring of insulation. Potion of strength. Cloth strength. Sure. That's the shop. You know what? Let's run into that water room and drown. Sorry, I think the sound was on again. Kind of annoying that it always turns back on. Well, that was not the thing. Identification. I want to climb out of there. Okay, the water room was not there. This or was it somewhere else? Cockatrice. 
think I might be dead. Cockatrice. Burned up about. I'm a statue. I guess that's what a cockatrice does. Okay, so, um. This area is bad over there. We're gonna try going north again a bit. Wow, this game actually does not fuck around, doesn't it? I mean, let's see. Let's see how far we can we can actually take this. There's an amulet. Do we have... Yes, we have you. Amulet S. An amulet of quickening. So let's do this. Okay. Are we quicker now? I think our AC went down. Like, in a bad way down, I mean. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This does not say anything. Um, why? Okay, that is not what it what does it though. Ah, there's so much. So much stuff going on. It's a bit of a stressful game, actually. But I like it so far. Kill the Glard. Okay. I think I need to really focus on combat tactics here. Yeah. I mean, there's all these folks down here that... Seem to be our buddies. So maybe we can do something with that as well. Another ring of insulation. Where are we? Now we are here. Now we are. We are here. Okay. I don't know where we actually need to go. This is the interesting thing. Potion of constitution. Drink that. You feel healthier. That's very good. Okay. You know, I'm playing this kind of in a, like, in kind of a reckless manner right now. But I think I need to really learn this game if I want to get good at it. Okay, more constitution is always good. Yeah, click, uh, that, oh, mud man, uh, uh, wow. But then there's stuff like this that just murders you. I did not best my previous score. No shit, I didn't. Okay. You know what? Soul seeking. Let's do the thing. Let's do soul trapping. No, not famine. Famine is probably not good. Let's do ash. No! Let's do ashes. Because those are definitely good. And, uh, yeah, let's continue. Let's go north here and try this again. Homunculus. New soul inhabits your ring. Right, so we did that. Um, soul trapping. What was the thing? The soul thing that I picked up. I picked up something. Oh god, my brain is just mush. Just mush. Was that a potion? Soul seeking, yeah. So let's quaff that potion. You s okay, you sense monsters. Okay, that does not have anything to do with anything. So I don't know why we would seek the souls is kind of the thing here. But, uh, sure. Silken scroll. You know what? Let's read it. Seem unaffected. Yellow flame. Hmm. 
didn't do, really do anything about us. No. Chart scroll. You have the oh, you have the power to destroy a race. It calls it race. Um, we have the scroll of genocide, so we can el completely eliminate one type of creature from the game. Yeah, no cockatrices anymore. <laughs> I think that could be useful because that was pretty dangerous. So now we've completely genocided cockatrices. Sis, 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 sis. Um, that might be good. Read G. And I want to know. Do I want to know anything actually? What does a spruce wand? A wand of hastening. Okay. Kill the blur. Pergrat. Draws charges from my wand. Okay. Well, that's scary. Dead blur. You feel faster. Okay. If we find a blur, we definitely want to eat the corpse. Because I think that permanently actually increases our speed. Which is good. Pale moss. Tiny fragments of my brain are destroyed. I mean, that's kind of bad. That is not good. Level seven. Ugh. Can we eat this? It tastes horrible. Okay. How about we don't go there? That's just stuff in here that is scary. Man, okay, Ring of Agility, that's, that's pretty good. Um, so let's do that, we have two of them, let's have one more. Okay, plus zero Ring of Agility, that's fine. Increase our agility by one, there's more Pale Moss. I think the Pale Moss, the brain stuff would probably be terrible if we were a magic user. For now, let's just have our brain rot away, why not? Who needs it? Is what I say. Oh, there's so many of them. Okay. Now we are here again. <sighs> Food ration. Troll. Yeah, that's a bit of damage. Eat the troll. Tastes horrible. It does nothing. Okay. You know, we kind of need to learn about the corpses that do stuff and the corpses that don't do stuff. So that's kind of all right. Um, gold pieces. Uh. <laughs> okay. We are... Somewhere we are on a on an island. There's fish that are bad. Wow. <laughs> I mean that was kind of nice. I was a bit into that. That's a vortex, and that okay. That's just a teleporter that teleports us to this terrible area. Ooh, yeah, let's not stay there. Um, okay. I mean, sure, chart scroll. I forgot what that was. Ah, oh, destroy a race. Did I already? No, I think I died, right? Cockatrice. No, no such race exists. Do I still have it? No, I destroyed it. Okay. Well, chart scrolls are always going to be scrolls of genocide in this. That's good to know. Um, food ration, sure. Wow, there's a lot of fire there. 
Mexico. I hate you. I hate you. And I'm dead. Okay. Ooh, yeah, this game does not fuck around. I mean, it's it's a classic roguelike. I don't expect it to fuck around, but uh, I don't really have a good grip on how to survive yet. However, yeah, I'm going... Oh, hello. Let's turn the sound off again. Okay, identification. Read identification. Is there anything we need identified? I only should check that beforehand, but Okay. So seeking, strength, agility. That's all good. We have a gold ring. So let's read identification on G the gold ring a ring of Genesis a ring of Phil Collins let's put that on and I have no idea what it does but it sounds interesting no yes food okay Stun jelly, that's fine. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff here. Is that a cockatrice? That is a cockatrice. Cockatrice, unfortunately, live in this safe game. I'm turning gray. Ah, uh, I'm going to be a statue and I'm going to be dead. Yeah, and that's it. Yeah, cockatrices are bad. I wonder what you can do. You're turning gray. It's an attack or something? I don't know. You know what? I think I'm going to be done for today. I think that's going to be my stream for now. Folks, thank you all for hanging out. Um, I think I'm going to return to this game. I think that was fun. Um, on Monday, let's say Monday, 10 o'clock European, Central European time, um, I'm going to be back and I'm going to play Caves of Cut again. But um, maybe at some other point I will return to this. That was pretty cool. Again, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. And uh, have a nice one. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.